Hello there, this is the Bookkeeper Master on YouTube. Welcome to another free Sage tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to export data from Sage to Excel. There are generally a couple of reasons why someone would want to do that. Number one is they want to manipulate the data somehow, and Excel's the best package to do that. Number two is they want to export data from Sage to Excel so that they can then save it as a CSV and import that into new accounting software. So it could be they're moving from Sage to QuickBooks or Sage to Zero, as an example. So how do we export the data from Sage to Excel? Unfortunately, there isn't like this option where we can just click export, export everything into one file and then import that into our new software. It doesn't work like that. You have to pick and choose what you want to export, and then with that information, with those files, you would then import that into your new software. If you're looking to manipulate data, then you just find specifically what you're looking for on Sage, export that, and then you can manipulate that in an Excel file. So how do we go about that? Well, on every module, such as the customer module here, the sales ledger, there is a send to Excel button. So if I click send to Excel, what it will do is all the information on this screen, the customers, their balances, their contact telephone number, etc., will now be on an Excel file. So all the modules have that. So if you want to export these lists, say your suppliers list, once again, there's a send to Excel button up here. If this is not showing, try right clicking and see if you can see it in a list and unhide it because it could be hidden. If we go to the bank accounts, you can see it's up here. It's the same thing with reports. So if we wanted to export, say, our customer details, let's say the customer address list, generally you would preview this or save it as a PDF. There is actually a report to Excel button. If I click that, it will then generate the report to Microsoft Excel. So here we go, now we have our list. And then you can manipulate this data or you can import it into your new accounting software or both, you might need to do both. So all the reports here, it doesn't matter what report it is, can be exported to Excel. And that's the same with the supplier reports, the bank reports, the nominal codes. You can export this list to Excel. You could run a report in the nominal module, say the nominal activity, and report that to Excel as well. So it's this button up here. It's the reports and then selecting report to Excel. The third main way to export data to Excel is activity on accounts. That could be activity on customers' accounts, on supplier accounts, could be activity on a nominal code or even a bank account. If we go to the bank account here and click on activity, we have all the transactions going through that account. If we wanted to export this, once again at the top here, there is a send to Excel button. I just press that. It's quite efficient, it doesn't take too long. It will then generate my Excel file for me, and this can be saved as a CSV or kept in Excel if Excel is fine. So let's just come out of here. Let me show you another one. So we go to nominal codes. If we wanted to export, say, let's say the sales accounts, the sales north, we can click on activity click send to Excel and once again generate this report. This one's bigger, so it's going to take longer. But you can export all that information to Excel. So that's how you export data from Sage to Excel. You have to specifically choose what you want and then just click the send to Excel or report to Excel buttons and Sage will do the rest for you. I hope this video was helpful. I have loads of other free Sage videos on my YouTube channel. Please check them out. If this video has been helpful. Please say so below. Please like and please subscribe.